chord of contact now let us take a circle equation like this we know that s is equal to x square plus y square plus 2gx plus 2fy plus c is equal to 0 now let p x1 comma y1 be any external point we know that from external point we can draw two tangents to the given circle so like this this is first tangent and this is going to be the second tangent the point where it touches the circle these two are called points of contact the line joining of these two points of contact is nothing but chord of contact so this is point a this is point b this is called chord of contact of this point p x1 y1 with respect to the circle s is equal to 0 assume that a alpha comma beta is there and b gamma comma delta is there now both the points are on the circle we know that equation of circle equation of tangent at a alpha comma beta is it is s1 is equal to 0 now in place of x square y square let us write uh, s1 notation x x1 in place of x1 y1 alpha beta x alpha plus y beta plus g into x plus alpha plus f into y plus beta plus c is equal to 0. Now this tangent equation always passes through the point p x1 y1. So it passes through p x1 y1. Now let us say substitute wherever x and y x1 alpha y1 beta plus g into x1 plus alpha plus f into y1 plus beta plus c is equal to 0. In the same fashion we can write equation of tangent at gamma delta and we can claim that it passes through x1 y1. So equation of tangent at b gamma delta is x gamma plus y delta plus g into x plus gamma plus f into y plus delta plus c is equal to 0 it passes through x1 comma y1 so you can write x1 gamma y1 delta plus g into x1 plus gamma plus f into y1 plus delta plus c is equal to 0 you can call this is equation 1 this is equation number 2 from equation 1 and 2 you observe that alpha beta is replaced by gamma delta that means alpha beta gamma delta are in variable position whereas x1 y1 is in fixed position so alpha beta replaced by gamma delta means now replaced by general coordinates so clearly x x1 plus y y1 plus g into x plus x1 plus f into y plus y1 plus c is equal to 0 are satisfied by a comma b but we know that a b is nothing but equation of chord of contact according to our notation this is nothing but s1 is equal to 0 so equation of chord of contact of any point p x1 y1 with respect to the given circle s equal to 0 is given by s1 is equal to 0 now you observe that when the point lies outside the circle the chord of contact is intersecting the circle in two points